welcome back to News Laundry Lite. The good news is that Justin Bieber was arrested. The bad news is that he was bailed out. The good news is that the Pope released doves to symbolize hope for peace in Ukraine. The bad news is that the doves were immediately attacked by crows and seagulls. So much for hope for peace. The good news is that the Prime Minister of Ukraine has resigned. The good news is that olive oil prices have dropped worldwide. The bad news is that this is a result of it being adulterated with cheaper oils, beta carotene and chlorophyll. The good news is that Rahul Gandhi's heart is in the right place. The bad news is that his brain seems to be missing. What will he do next? Well, let's find out. Hello and welcome to TNT, the show where we bring you tomorrow's news today. In his recent interview with Arnab Goswami, Rahul Gandhi had spoken about the unfairness of the Indian political system. This left viewers baffled as the Indian political system has evolved around his own party, the Congress. But today, all that confusion has cleared as the contents of Rahul's personal diary have been leaked to the media. In it, the Congress scion has listed out a detailed plan of action to ensure the Congress is defeated. His plan seems to be centred on projecting himself as the weakest, most insipid leader the nation has ever seen and to embarrass the Congress party at every occasion. His interview makes a lot more sense now. His diary also points to a culture of sycophancy among the Congress top brass that Rahul considers integral to his plan. Here's an excerpt from his diary. Dear diary, today was hilarious. I just walked into Markin's press conference and stole the show. And he totally played along. I can do anything I want with these fools. The other day I mentioned that I like Bob Marley. And two hours later I caught Rajiv Shukla trying to learn the words to Buffalo Soldier. Mani Shankar Iyer is also an integral part of his plan, albeit without his knowledge. Rahul has dedicated an entire chapter of his diary to motivating Mani Shankar Iyer to say the rudest things possible so that more people turn against the Congress. I don't know about you, Ranjan, but he certainly knows what he's doing there. The hardest part, according to the diary, is the final stage of Mr. Gandhi's plan, which is to join the Aam Aadmi Party. I think that's going to be the easiest part, considering the clowns they accept. <laughs> The bad news is that we don't have his diary yet. The good news is that TNT's explanation makes more sense than believing he's actually trying to help Congress. But what do people think? Well, NL Light took to the streets to find out. Hi, I'm joined by... Kalka. Bilal Hassan. Tanya. Shubham. Lalit. Israr. Yes, Aspi. There you Ashish. Ashish, what do you do? I don't do anything. I'm going to be in the job. And Rahul Gandhi, what do you do? I don't do anything. I'm going to be in the job. Did you happen to watch the biggest political interview of 2014? Well, is it about Arnav Goswami and Rahul Gandhi? I missed that. Rahul Gandhi, no, I didn't watch it. No, no. I don't like watching interviews and all. A lot of controversy is going on about that. I just had a glimpse of the debate. No, I didn't. But now I'm going to watch it. Uh, no, I read about it in the newspaper the next day. What did you get information from it? It was interesting. It was a very good speech, of course. I didn't get anything. It's bad. The first thing I heard was the questions that he asked. He answered completely different things. It was 10 years ago. You should do it. 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 But then, somehow, it lacked, uh, you know, confidence. And it was a funny interview. What do you think his three biggest achievements are? Um... Uh, Biggest achievements? Rahul Gandhi's achievements? Um, he's a <laughs> no achievements. Uh, he's the son of a big politician and... Uh, I can't say, I really can't. <laughs> nothing on top of my head, nothing, nothing. Three things. You can say he's, uh, born, with a, he's born with a golden spoon. He is Sonia Gandhi's son, so yes, he's, got, he's born with a silver spoon, so yes. He's carrying forward the legacy. The surname works, like in Bol Bollywood, Kapoor works, same in politics. Saying he hasn't done anything much basic. He might have won one election, right? That's what's the biggest achievement. I think so. Adam Goswami, you know, he's not a big politician. I know more about Rahul Gandhi, but he's a nice guy, he's a good guy. Rahul Gandhi is famous. Somehow, Arnab Goswami uh, is the chief of the party. Yeah, he's the chief of the party. He's the chief of the party. Somehow, Arnab Goswami is just too uh, strong on, on, on television. And uh, of course, that, that what that, that's what keeps the television channel going, but then, uh, <laughs> you know. If Arnab won by chance, then what will happen? Look, I haven't seen him yet. I haven't seen him in interviews. I haven't heard him from him. 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 
but you know some would say that rahul gandhi you know he's been brought up with his sister and his mother so do you think he has a better idea of you know women's issues sorry uh no not really uh but uh, really not interested in rahul gandhi like i said not much for rahul gandhi fan not really following his uh, his actions but yeah so i feel arvind kejriwal on the other hand is amazing so yeah. i'm i'm you know i'm really not interested in rahul gandhi hey, aapko rahul gandhi kaise lagta hai sabse kharab sabse kharab sabse badhiya hai i would like to appreciate narendra singh modi I don't Narendra Singh Modi Narendra Modi sorry Narendra Modi sorry really sorry Rahul Gandhi said things like Bharat ek soch hai Congress ek soch hai what does he even mean <laughs> uh Bharat ek soch hai <laughs> Congress jo sochti hai wahi soch hai baaki Congress public ke bare mein kuch nahi sochti hai <laughs> sochna hi nahi aata mujhe bas I just told you na Bharat ek soch hai for him it is a soch only hona chahiye ek nayi soch honi chahiye अभी हमने कांग्रेस का एक रूप देखा है क्या पता इस वाले मैच में वो अच्छा स्कोर बनाए सो या वेल आई मीन आई आई डोंट रियली नो व्हाट ही मींस बट देन आई जस्ट होप ही मींस समथिंग गुड फॉर द इकॉनमी इन द कंट्री ऑफ टुडे सो या डील दिल्ली मेट्रो दैट वाज डन बाय कांग्रेस ऑफ कोर्स आई डू अप्रिशिएट दैट और व्हाटएवर हैव बीन अच्छी सोच थी अस वो तो ऐसी अच्छी सोच थी पर एज आई टोल्ड समथिंग जब हम मेट्रो पे चल रहे हैं हम बोल सकते हैं मैं सोच पे चल रहा हूं एग्जैक्टली ये कब भी सोच हो सकता है ऐसा कुछ नहीं कब सोच नहीं ये बस पीने के लिए आपका बैग सोच मैं सोचता हूँ इसके बारे में कई बार इसमें क्या क्या होना चाहिए सिर्फ सोच में सारा काम चल रहा है देश कहीं चल नहीं रहा भारत इज नॉट अ सोच भारत इज अ कंट्री यू नो दी आर टी आई इज राइट टू इन्फॉर्मेशन इज राइट इन्फॉर्मेशन राइट इन्फॉर्मेशन यू नो दी आर टी आई इज आर टी आई नहीं Rahul is Tamil in information. It helps the South Indian uh, community know more about what's happening in the central government. Okay. Do you think that's a, a good move by Rahul Gandhi? I don't have any more knowledge about this. Yep. You know, somewhere if it is done by Rahul Gandhi totally in his hand, but or he has a major part to play in it, then I would appreciate that. Obviously, he deserves credit for it. He is the one who, uh, you know, who has uh, come up and spoken about it. So yes. Yeah. Sort of. Maybe. I don't know. चालीस से कम उम्र कितने लोग हैं यहाँ पे आप आप सबको लगता है राहुल गांधी आप सबके साथ कनेक्ट कर सकता है यूथ के साथ um, well, um, my personal opinion, no, no. ऐसा क्या माना जब तो हो जाए तो चालीस के ऊपर हो He's close to 50. How can a person be a close to 50 be a youth icon? <laughs> Yeah. Saying that you 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 uh, basically you're a, you're a, you're an icon for youth and doing things for the youth are two separate things. If I'm going some uh, uh, somewhere and I'm going with a guy who's not able to you know uh, really earn well, but when I look at him, I'm like uh, it's just a guy. And when a guy comes with an Audi, they're like, oh sir, what is that? So we have to change that picture. We have to bring everyone as an equal. You know, everyone has to be an equal person. Then uh, everyone should get that respect. Money can never earn respect. It's we who can earn and give respect and take respect. The bad news for the Congress is that people really don't think very highly of Rahul Baba. The good news for him is that at least he has his looks. But he looks lost. The good news is that fish oil is good for your health. The bad news is that whale sharks are being hunted into extinction to produce it. The good news is that Chinese scavengers discovered one hundred thirty thousand dollars of gold in the garbage. The bad news is that the police tracked them down and took it away. Guess they haven't heard of finders keepers. The bad news for you is that it's the end of the show. Now click like, subscribe, share, and tune in next week for more.